guys. Um, today we have a box. Just a little priority mail box. Um, I'll fill you on the story here. I got my slash 4x4 uh, LCG. I'm going to head start opening these up too while I can tell you this. I got my slash 4x4 new. Um, or not new, but just rebuilt. And I bought, I had a used castle system and I put it in there to run it a few times and that really wasn't cutting it. So now I went out and bought a Tegan system, bought an RX8 and Pro 4 HD. Nice high dollar stuff. I ran the RX8 first night. I ran one lap, and I ran a second lap, and then a third. And all of a sudden the truck stops. So I didn't know what the problem was. I tried to look into it more. This isn't working. Hang on. I looked into it a little bit more. I started walking over to the truck, and that's when I saw the smoke start to pour out. And it caught fire. And then I hurried up and unplugged the battery and blew the fire out before it did any damage to the truck or the batteries or, or anything that I thought was still working. So then I took it back to my bench and I looked at the ESC and I'll include some pictures in here too. And I looked at the ESC and it was just scarred. It was burnt on the one side. One, one of the poles came undone from the bottom. And just jacked it up. Good time. Got it real nice. Um, and then I called Tekin, and they were like, well, send it to us, we'll get it taken care of. And two days later, Christmas break, and I had it, and it's been sitting. Since they were closed for like three or four weeks during Christmas break. So, now I just got it back, and I'm trying to sit here and open it. Sorry, I'm not, I don't have the best materials to do so. There we go. Right, let's try and cut this. Body reamer scissors. Body, body reamer scissors are good for everything. See this? There's our order form. Hey, I'm gonna go ahead and pick you guys up. Okay. Uh, here's the order form. There's the order form. Yay. Yes. Brand new or actually. back and here's the t-shirt that they tossed in too. Nice. That's sweet. I'll certainly wear that. Because I mean I don't dislike Tekken for what happened. I mean I'm still gonna run their stuff. But they did say that it was their fault. They said they forgot to add some C wire or whatever and want to Powered it up and once it got over like 75 degrees, it, it like blew up. But so, oh crap, I guess. Right, sorry, sorry for the bad footage. Okay, here we go. Brand new RX8 Gen 2. I'm putting it back in my slash 4x4, which is in here. And it tore apart. I hope you can see that. I really hope you can. There's a pro. You see it, there's a Pro 4 HD 3500 KV in there. And I guess tonight I gotta go get this ESC wired up. Um, so I can't solder. I'm not gonna practice on something like this. So I guess I'll run up to the hobby shop, get this dude soldered up, and put the truck back together. They got the servo and the G6, which is that was weird. <laughs> I kind of tore it up last weekend. But that's another story for another time. So, well, here you guys go. I guess I'll I'll tune you in on whatever happens next, and hopefully this one doesn't blow up. Wish me luck.